Uh, hey everybody, it's Hulkarim 100 here. Uh, it, if I sound horrible, don't mind me, I just have a shitty cold. And whoever gave me that shitty cold, I hate you! Oh god, I feel like crap. It is currently 2.01 in the afternoon. Um, I know that all of you usually, you know, count on me to make content. Usually I'm a regular content maker. I mean, I, my content is not that great, but I try, in other words. Um, unfortunately, my PS4 Pro is not working. I was going to get it repaired, but it would have cost so much money. So I just thought to myself, hmm, okay, um, I'll just get a pre-owned one when I get the chance and you know not bother getting my other one repaired because it cost more um obviously you know with the crisis we're having here in UK because of the the whole Russia and Ukraine um war you know it's had an impact on our energy sources the gas and electric and stuff like that um the bills are getting a bit higher so it's gonna it's gonna probably take me a good while before I can even get a pre-owned um, PS4 Pro again. So please bear with me, and I will get one eventually, and we'll live stream again. I know that some of you may. I don't know if you all miss me or not, but if I'm sure at least one or two people miss my content, so I will get back to it eventually. I probably will just do mobile games for a while. I know not many mobile games are that great, but I know a lot of people do like me playing Bejeweled, so I'll probably upload something to do with Bejeweled. Um, and then, um, I don't know, um, I could do New York, New York Nights, because I know people did like it when I did New York Nights. You know, I could do New York Nights too again and try and make some different choices and see see that what the different end would be like so i could try that again um it just depends how i'm feeling but at the moment i'm not doing any content because i feel like shit this cold is wiping me out for six um the other day i had an appointment i came home and the first thing I did was I crashed out on my bed and I didn't wake up until later on, like real later on. And then the next day I woke up, my nose was blocked, I was sneezing like crazy and my mouth was dry. I My throat felt like it had a cactus down it. My glands were swollen. My body was aching all over. I am, I don't. I'm not sure if it's COVID or not, though, because I know that I've had the mild case of COVID a few times. Um, um, I'm, I don't think it is COVID, though, because so far I can still smell and taste everything and I don't have a temperature. Usually those are the two biggest red flags when it comes to COVID and... I don't have any, but just to be on the safe side, I've ordered a rapid COVID testing kit. Um, I'm gonna order a PCR test as well, because one of my fam, well, quite a few of my family members actually have cancer, and uh, yeah, cancer and colds or cancer and COVID, not good mixtures you know with someone especially if someone is having keep well if someone's not having chemotherapy i'm not sure if if it doesn't affect them but i know for a fact that if someone's having chemotherapy or radiotherapy it suppresses their immune system which means that they're most vulnerable to infections and one of my fam two two or one or two of my family members is currently having treatment for their cancer so i cannot risk getting it and giving it to them i mean i'm not going out visiting any of my family members at the moment who have that but um 
one of my family members does live near me though and they do have cancer they're not having any treatment though but still i don't want to count my chickens as they say so i'm gonna get the pcr test i'm gonna get the rapid covid test check it see what it comes back as hopefully it'll come back clear like i said you know those two red flags the the loss of t sense of taste and smell i don't have that the um the uh what's it called the temperature i don't have a temperature but still i want to be safe and sorry so i've ordered the tests oh god but yeah i won't be doing any content for just only a few days until i've recovered depending on how bad this cold or whatever it is i've got depending on how bad it is so far it's wiped me out completely and i do not feel good but <sighs> i will be getting a ps4 pro again and i will eventually be live streaming i may just i i i'm not i'm not sure yet because obviously bills bills come first but at some point i will definitely get back to live streaming and yeah so that's the plan that's the plan so far i do hope that everyone is doing well you know um i'm sorry that i've you know been away the last time i did any content was um about a month ago with the whole the whole queen passing away and then obviously you know i uploaded that video about that disgusting racist damn woman on the train i think she was in new york city i'm not sure but yeah i haven't done any much content and the reason why i've been offline is because i've been having some personal problems back at home so i have not had any time to get round making content as i say i do apologize if i sound weird it's just my nose is a bit congested my sinuses are blocked um so i don't sound like my usual self um yeah so i hope everyone is staying safe doing well for themselves i hope you all had a fantastic or hulk-tastic um summer and i have i hope have <laughs> i don't know why i said that i hope you do have a hulk-tastic um halloween or autumn as well christmas is around the corner um i i mean usually usually my old self would not be excited by that but i am pretty excited about christmas this time and hopefully that will be good for me <laughs> so, and hopefully that'll be good for everyone else too i hope everyone has had a good 2022 so far obviously it was some place some places or memories in in this year have been a bit disappointing i mean we did lose england did lose its queen which was very sad you know, I, she was my favourite monarch and I was very, very, very heartbroken about that. You know, I exchanged letters with her and I got so used to her being a big part of the country. And, you know, the royal family are not just the royal family. They become your family as well, like I said in in my posts, you know. So they become a part of your life and... <laughs> I'm not laughing because I find it funny. I'm just laughing as in like a uh, nervous twitch thing. But yeah. Um, it was such a shame to lose her. You know. It's not going to be the same. I mean. I mean Charles. You know. He's not my favourite. but And I'm not that fond of him. But. I'm sure he's going to do well. And. Someday in the future, William will do well too. So I hope all the best for King Charles and Prince William. Anyway, guys, I'm going to go because I'm exhausted and I need my rest. I need a bit of R&R. &R. You all take care. 
like and subscribe if you want to you know it's up to you share this if you will but yes i will make some content eventually patience the virtue adios